Many of us are familiar with recycling. We know it's something we should do, but there's a lot of misinformation that can make it confusing. So we're going behind the scenes to learn the benefits of recycling right. First of all, where are we? What is this place? Well, this place is uh, California Waste Solutions, and we are a family business here for over 30 years. We are passionate about what we uh, do. We love what we're doing, and we like to clean up the environment and help the next generations now uh, and within our community. All of the recyclables uh, in the city of Oakland are being collected with our collections fleet, and they all come to our facilities here in uh, Oakland. Collections trucks start off at 5.30 in the morning, and when they reach their routes in the city of Oakland, they collect uh, all the recyclables from the carts. When they get a full load, they bring it back to our facility here to uh, dump into the uh, tipping floor. And as you can see here, our tractor loader is loading up the infeed, and this is uh, going to our pre-sort, where it goes into a machine that's sorting all these recyclables out and segregating them from fiber paper to cardboard to bottles and cans to tin cans to aluminum cans. Uh, all the types of recyclables that are produced from uh, each of the residents. Recycle. Oakland Recycles, yes, it's a joint partnership uh, with the city and also waste management and us, California Waste Solutions being the recycler, pick up of all the recycling and waste management is the service provider for the garbage and the organics. So it's a, a joint effort to send a message out and thanks to the uh, city of Oakland to uh, be able to provide that, uh, that platform for us to do so. CWS picks up recycling from Oakland residents every day. Recycled items are brought to the facility to be sorted and separated. When items are recycled right, there's less chance for contamination and keeps trash out of the recycling truck and materials out of landfills. This is our pre-sort. This is the first line where all the employees start pulling out trash, pulling out contamination to put into the bunker chutes that it goes down to the bunker. When plastic bags get mixed in with other recyclables, they're difficult to sort out and often jam or damage the machines at the recycling facility and slow down the recycling process. Why is recycling so important? Recycling is so important because there's many various benefits to everyone, to every human being. First of all, to have a cleaner environment, to have a better environment for our future, for the next generations. In addition to that, when you recycle right, um, they, we don't have to tap into our natural resources and we can recycle and reduce the cost of the production of the types of materials, the types of products that we can, as consumers, buy and have to pay a higher cost to that. Having recycling right is uh, multiple benefits for everyone and it reduces all the harmness that the sorters and everyone else has to go through. As you can see, the wet fiber, the wet paper, it gets jammed and stuff in our machine, so our production efficiency goes down. Oh, yeah. What goes in our door is approximately close to 30% of contamination, which are garbage is being sorted out, segregated, and landfilling. And that also creates also a cross-contamination with our cleaner materials and products, where we have to keep to a certain standard to be able to meet the market demands. So the contamination that comes in impacts uh, the facility, impacts the, uh, our employees, creates a health issues for our employees to sort out the contamination. Sometimes it could be uh, hazardous like needles and such. When you shift the problem, understand that someone else is dealing with that problem. I think a lot of people probably think of themselves as great recyclers. They're doing their part, but it, recycling right is the key phrase. What exactly does that mean? That means uh, recycling right means clean, empty, and dry. It also means making sure you have a plan that starts at home and knowing what recycling materials are accepted in your bin. It's important to have bottles and food jars empty of liquids and clean of food residue. Plus, paper and cardboard items must be dry. Many of us use bags for recycling, but it's best to keep items loose in your bin. Bagging recyclables in plastic bags will result in recycling treated as trash and will end up in the landfill. Recyclables should always be placed loose in the cart. Workers sorting the recycling have to be able to see the recyclables to separate them into each type. We're reaching out to all the residents and doing whatever we can to send the uh, message in various ways to get the residents' attention and tell them and show them that, you know, the, the need to recycle right. And I think it's time that we fix the problem from uh, where it begins, which is at the curb and where the residents are.